That's right, kids. This is a Renji story. Buckle up. It's taking you just about long enough to make it here, Aburai Renji. <laughs> you think you're gonna sneak up on me? You clearly have no idea who you're dealing with! Aburai Renji, as I just said. Crap, he has an idea who he's dealing with! I am Zyalaparo Granz, designated Espada number eight. An Espada, huh? Well, Zyalaparo, pink hair too much of a chicken to face me with my friends around Granz? I guess you're just too chicken to face me with my friends around, huh? Gotta divide us up! There! Now you outnumber me, Brosif. Oh, you're in for it now! Hey, now that's no way to treat best friend Counselor Admiral General Don Gonchaka! I have super best friend seniority on your lesser friend behind! If you don't heckin' mind, I'm trying to have a showdown with one of the biggest bats! Mega best friend Council's gonna hear about this! The universe would probably be a better place without you in it, you know that? As entertaining as this comedy of errors is proving to be, I was hoping to terminate you relatively quickly. What's got you in such a rush to die? It's really not that hard to understand. Do you remember a particular Arankar who went by the name of Ilfort Grants? What? Oh, you mean Ford Fiesta? Yeah, I remember him. Dude's on my resume now. Well, Brosif. Do you not see the connections between him and the man in front of you? Oh yeah, I see what's happening here. Good. You're some kind of Ford Fiesta fanboy, that's it! Or maybe you were his boyfriend and you're out for blood. That's disgusting. Oh, and you're homophobic! You're just the worst kind of people! He was my brother, you ignorant barbarian. Ew, you dated your brother! In any case, if you're out for revenge, you came to the wrong guy. Soon I'll be adding you to my resume under successfully murdered clients. Bankai! See this? This is called going straight to Bankai. This is what all Soul Reapers should be doing in this war all the time. Now let's get him! Zombie Maru! I do like a man who comes on strong, Brosif. Unfortunately. What? Confused. Not again! Come on, when you break a Bankai, the damage is permanent! I can't fix that! Oh, is that true? Uh, no That's a lie I yelled just now! To confuse you! And it worked! Ha <laughs> ha! Now let me elucidate you on what just occurred, Brosif. You see, I've seen you fight before, and- Knock it off! Hmm? I get it! It? Yeah, it. This whole it happening right now. I'm in the know. You don't need to explain it. You batman me. I... batman you. Kinda slow on the uptake, aren't you? You're clearly some kind of brainy scientist type like Mayuri. With your type, it's always something like, I studied your spiritual energy, as if that somehow means you can just vaccinate anything I can do out of existence. Mayuri's the same goddamn way. You science my Bonkai to death, you batman me. Pray tell, Aburai, why does that mean I batman you? Cause no matter how much I claim that it's improbable, or that it doesn't make sense, or that the circumstances would have to be unfathomably in your favor, you're gonna get away with it! I guess that's that then, isn't it? Now you've seen the countermeasures I've put in place. My revenge is all but assured, Brosif. You must have really loved your brother. I guess I can respect that. Not really. You must have a strong sense of family honor. I guess I can respect that. Not even remotely. You must have an unquenchable thirst for revenge and would take it at the slightest provocation. I know I can respect that. Hey, how is he your brother anyways? You're a hollow, right? You're both past the level of a Juhas, which means you were once within Gillian. 
and asserted your personality enough to take over the host body. You evolved and took your own form? I feel like family doesn't exist past that stage. You are correct. About what? So is he your brother? What does you are correct mean? It's just like you say. Hollows are confusing! Why are you so unnecessarily confusing? Just like a hollow to dodge important questions. While we're asking questions, when two souls in soul society have a baby, where does the soul come from? That's what I thought. Come on! This isn't even gonna be fun! I'm having a blast. And it looks like you are too. Because I blasted you with energy. <laughs> Master Silapuro! We have news! Well, if it isn't my beloved, irreplaceable creations, Lumina and Verona, what brings you here? A spider number nine has died! <laughs> he died and left his tasty corpse behind. Hmm. Oh, wow. So he did. What's even more shocking, Lumina and Verona, is that I don't care! Hey, they're just trying to help. Don't gotta be a jerk. What do I care if Aro Nero died? Even if he did take that female Soul Reaper with him? Say that again. When Espada number nine died, he did so only because the Soul Reaper with an ice-based Zanpak toe used the last of her resources to do so and is laying dead on the ground. Now then, shall we get back to our fight, Rosa? How dare you! Rukia Kutsuki would never get taken down! If I'm remembering that name right from my reports, this is the Soul Reaper who was beat up by various low-class hollows in the world of the living, was made into a damsel in distress as part of Lord Groven's plans, and was casually impaled and discarded by Grimjo. Correct? Or am I thinking of the wrong Rukia Kutsuki? All right, smartass, so she occasionally does get taken down. A lot even. But she's tough. She'll pull through no matter what. Let's see you dodge this! <laughs> All right, cool, we saw you dodge it. Good job. Should I bring up the issue that you're facing an opponent who's god modding on you? You just did. So no then. Whatever tricks you might have are irrelevant, aren't they? What you gonna do? Your Zanpak toe is only good for cutting or bludgeoning, I guess. I'm not judging how you choose to use it. You know, I might have overprepped for this. In case you pulled some surprise out, I prepared these, my fraction. Consider it a second stage of this boss battle. Too bad you seem under level, Rosef. Oh, you want me to beat up your minions? I can do that. If they ain't got a name, they're right up my alley. <laughs> Knock yourself out! And I mean that literally, of course. Please, knock yourself unconscious. Damn it! This isn't good. Fighting a brainiac like this isn't in my wheelhouse. This must be what Ishida felt like when he took down my Yuri made himself immortal but at what cost Kuratsuchi. I just gotta think. What? What? Ishida do? That's exactly what he'd do! Wait, was that real or was that me planning things? Did I just will myself into being a Quincy? Yeah, go Reggie! It would seem that following the ruckus has led me exactly where I needed to be! Hello, Soul Reaper. Having some trouble dealing with this nerd? Listener, you shows up just in the nick of time because I was totally about to die, Ishida! You get out of here! I don't need your help! Well, that just sounds like he's just ungrateful. The Council of Mega Friends decrees that he either be devoured, toes and all, or left to his fate. Pache, I'm gonna need you to just... Can you just... Okay? Excuse me, well-dressed stranger. Do you intend to intrude on my battle with the second seat over there? Kinda already did. Who are you? I am Xylopero Grants, Espada number eight. Interesting. That works out then. Ah! Saruchi sends her regards. Or I mean, maybe she does. She was really angry at me because of you. So that's her regards. She might be dead now. 
Kinda just left her on the ground. Probably doesn't care for either of us, honestly, but those are her regards right there. Hey, Ishida, you should have a rap battle. What? Yeah, you should have a rap battle with them. You do that once and suddenly it's all you're about. What in the name of Pizzagate? Hashtag impossible. <laughs> Don't tell me. You analyzed my spiritual energy and now you're Batmaning me. See, it's a thing. Oh, let me break a few things down for you, Quincy. First, Sarucci was a hack who was kicked out of the Espada because she demanded we build a shopping mall exclusively for her use. And two, I've been analyzing the spiritual energy of all you intruders since the moment you arrived here. So you're basically a Spada Maiori, huh? Well, guess I'll just do what I did then. Harrow to the... You are Batmaning me. So hard right now. Make quick work of them, my pets! Thanks for that, Soul Reaper! You better have a plan, because I haven't got any bright ideas here. Last time I fought a guy like this, I just self-destructed and took him with me. Unfortunately, I lack the glove required to do it again. Without taking off the glove literally, the gloves can't come off metaphorically. Self-destruct, huh? You think if I can make an opening, you can do some Quincy thing and give him the old what for? As long as the old what for isn't rapping against him, then yes. Yes, I can do that. Just let me know in advance. The Quincy thing you're gonna do, will it involve arrows? The answer may surprise you. Pretending I don't Camry? Let's put this thing to bed! Are you going to talk me to death, Broso? <laughs> My buddy Ishida took out this other scientist by self-destructing one time. I'm not really into this. I think you don't understand the sort of experimentation I'm about. We got off to a bad start. Let me introduce myself again. Huh? I'm a Bar Irenji, a lieutenant of the 13 Court Guard Squads. Victor against such opponents as Ford Fiesta. <laughs> oh, you <coughs> idiot! I'm immune to your spiritual pressure! All you did was singe my fucking clothes! It is you who is the idiot. Huh? When we were standing beside each other before we attacked, did you think we were just shooting the breeze? We had a plan, you buffoon! Is that a lightsaber? This is my lightsaber! It doesn't matter if you had a plan, Quincy. I've already, as you two so generously put it, batman you. Batman? Don't mind if I do. Ah! What is this? Release me! I could give you the complicated explanation about how it steals spiritual energy, turning it in on its user, and the toys I use to construct it. But I don't think I will. For example... See this? Ooh, what's this thing Ishida has? Sure looks interesting, doesn't it? I wonder what this thing does! Explain this immediately! You're the scientist. Why don't you observe what it does and tell me? Rest in pieces, Cyloporo Grads. Uh, what's wrong, Ultra Friend? Did you finally get tired? Yous has been running for 40s episodes. I sense his spiritual energy. I know this person. Ichigo Kurosaki. What a pleasure it is to finally encounter you again. 
you again. Ukiora Schiffer. That is correct. And what are you doing here? Come to stop me? This tower is my home. You are currently standing in my foyer. Oh. Indeed. Well, sorry for intruding. But also, you can go right to hell? Thanks for watching. We can't know until this is up, but I bet YouTube gave us the runaround on this. Again. I bet the next one's already probably done. Anyways, if you want to support the channel, you can check out our Patreon. We're coming up on a season finale pretty dang quick. Never been a better time. Special thanks to our $100 patrons, Mo1216, Echo Call, That Lizard, Ben Meltzer, Bandit1683, and Sporklord. Woo! <laughs>